Are you okay? You all right? About time you woke up. I was starting to think maybe they'd fried your brains or something. You got a headache, right? Don't worry. That'll get better. I don't know if it'll matter, but it'll get better. They must really like you. At least they let me keep my clothes. Looks like they stripped you of everything. Yeah? Well, then wake the hell up, because I'm tired of being stuck in it. Sorry, kid, but this is really happening. You're stuck here just like me. You've got it all wrong, kid. You're in here with me. This is my little slice of heaven, not yours. Not a good time for jokes, I guess. Look, I don't know why they put you in here with me. Maybe it's another experiment. Not like I can ask them to find out. But since you asked, name Soma. Beyond that, I'm thinking not much matters if we're going to stay stuck in here. Your guess is as good as mine. I can't understand what they're saying. I don't remember half of what they did to me. And that might be a good thing. I know we ain't the only ones. There's a whole bunch of us in here. They'll pluck folks out every now and then. Sometimes they bring them back, sometimes they don't. Either way, I ain't keen to find out what they're doing. I've been here for a little while, but haven't found a way to... Shit. You hear that? It's coming again. Get back against the wall now. coming for us. I'm thinking maybe now you can understand it's a good idea to get the hell out of here? Okay, yeah. Let's do something about getting out. Well, there ain't no easy way out. Trust me. I've looked. Can't even find anything to pry open, see what's blocking the doorway. I'm thinking they did us a favor, putting us together in here like this. And I say we use it to our advantage. They're keeping an eye on us, you know. Watching us. So I say we give them a little show. Give them a reason to pay a little extra attention to us. They want us alive for something. Who knows what? Point is, if it looks like one of us is going to kill the other, they'll step in to stop it. So that's what we do. We throw a few punches, make it look real, and then jump them when they come in to break it up. Hell if I know, but at least it's a start. It's better than sitting here waiting for them to experiment on us even more. You gotta be kidding me. You always this paranoid? Think about it. You've been lying here a while now, out cold. If I wanted you dead, why wait till now? I could have just made sure you never woke up. No fuss at all. But I didn't, did I? So yeah, I'm thinking you can afford to show me a little trust. Now are we doing this or what? All right, I'll hold back on you. Make sure you don't get too roughed up, okay? And you be ready. Soon as they come in to get us, you take them down. Yeah, we're really fighting now, aren't we? Ow, that really hurts. Yeah, we're really fighting now, aren't we? Ow, that really hurts. And oh, you're mine, sucker. Oh, damn it. Who knows?
knows how long it'll be before they send more after us. Come on, come on, we don't have time to waste. Get your shit and let's get moving. Can't be real. This can't be happening. Are you escaping? Do you want to see the rest of this place? I've seen a bunch. I can show you if you want. Great! You have Hello. to shut that Where's off and open the door here. Well, not really shut it off. More like blow it up. If you turn off the coolant, it'll get really hot and then explode. So be careful. so much for that idea. She suckered you good, huh? See? I told you I could help. Sure. I love exploring, and it's been a while since I've been out and about. We'll have to be careful, because they'll be mad that we're out. But it's okay. I know how to get through the steamworks. We need to get to the big engine room, so I can show you the rest of the ship. Let's go. Oh, I've been here a while. A long while. Sometimes I can sneak out of my cell and go explore. I've seen a bunch of the ship. It's pretty neat. But they always catch me and put me back here. I don't have any family anymore. My mom and dad died a while ago, before I ended up here. You know, back when all the bombs dropped on everything. Yeah, it was right after that. And then me and my sister, we got pulled up here. Except, I haven't seen her in a long time. Sure! We need to go to the big engine thing, and then from there we can go up to the top of the ship. That's where the guy in charge is. I've only seen him once or twice, but he's extra mean. I guess you'll probably have to kill him or something, huh? Sure. I'll stay right with you.
for a second. There's more of them coming. I guess they're already looking for us. I can sneak past them in the vents, but you're too big to fit. We'll have to figure out how to get around. But I can help!
Okay, I'll show you what I found. If you want to get out of here, I think it'll help. Come on, follow me. Aw, oh, nuts. They turned it off! Last time I was here, I used this to get to the top of the ship. It's kind of like an elevator, only it doesn't just go up and down. Feels sort of tingly, too. They must be pretty angry that we're exploring. Oh, I know. Come on, I know another way up. This is it. Pretty neat, huh? I never had the courage to wake them up, but I think you're going to need to. The spaceman has a suit, and we need him to use it. I've seen these all over. They put people in them, and the people go to sleep. They stay asleep for a really long time, too. Be careful if you touch them, though. They're really cold. I don't know. I've never talked to them. Sometimes I'd come and look at them and wonder why they're dressed like that. You see that one guy? He has this really neat suit on, like armor or something. And that other guy? He looks just like a cowboy. I saw pictures of cowboys in books. I never saw a real one, though. This is going to be so neat! Where are they? Where are they, little buggers? Aliens? That what you call them? So you woke me, huh? Who the hell are you? Do I really look that stupid, kid? This ain't a ship. I don't hear water, and I sure as hell don't feel us rocking. So tell me another one. Besides, you don't look trapped to me. How do I know you ain't working with those little green bastards? You got a point there, kid. Let me out of that thing does count for something. Tell you what, I usually ride solo, but I'll stick with you for now. You try and pull anything stupid, and I'll bury you.
Well, what do you want? Hey, Soma, can you tell me how it all ends up? What's... what's going on? Who are all these people? My what? Who the hell are you? Oh my god. Wait a minute. Aliens! I was taken by aliens! You! You must be the aliens trying to get into my mind. Well, that's not gonna work! Private Elliot Tekorian, U.S. Army medic. Serial number 3477809. That's all I'm telling you. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe you assumed human form. I heard they can do that. Or you are human, but they took over your mind. We have no idea how limitless their powers are. You do? Then you're telling me the truth. Those aliens took you too. Look, I just want to get out of here and get back to things the way they were. Back with my guys. Wait a minute. My men. My unit. Have you seen them? Oh my god. I'm responsible for them. And now they're lost. Or dead. Please, if you mean what you say, that we're all in this together, then you've got to help me find out what happened to them. Thank you. Thanks so much. Sorry about all this. I just can't believe this is happening. I'd really like to, but when I woke up on this ship for the first time, all of my medical gear was gone. I saw that... お主は何者ここはどこだ拙者の剣拙者の剣はどこだ何を言っておるのだこの地に見覚えはない一体拙者に何をした拙者の剣を今すぐ返すのだ早く返せるかなんとかせるか拙者の剣は一体どこにある
Hey there, what'd you need? Hmm. Sounds like I may be of some use in there. If there are other people in stasis, I could help revive them or something. Just watch my back. Come on, you bastard! <laughs> chambers. They must be planning to fill them all with specimens from our planet. Experiment on this, you sons of bitches!
smash that. Take them down. What the hell did you do that for? There might have been a chance to save them. What the fuck is wrong with you? If you don't trust me and I'll forget it. It's too late. Wait just a second. Let me take some of this cryogenic compound back to the engine core. I might be able to make some use of it. Hey there. What Just hurry up. Take this! Ah! No. Oh! Should this many people from Earth? Oh my god. Oh hey, what's up? Sure. us from behind. Quick, find some cover. So that's the generator. Now, how the heck do we destroy it? Hey, you're doing great. Only two more generators and we Okay, whatever you think is best. Yeah, I think so. Before I was shipped out to Anchorage, I was trained in cryoscience. We were hoping to apply that to medicine. The compounds we used weren't that different from this cryogenic liquid. I'm pretty sure I can make us some improvised weapons from it. I'm thinking something along... Check back with... Not yet. Got one, eh? You can pat yourself on the back when you've blown up all. When 
Now you're speaking my language. Hell yeah, I'll come with you. Suit yourself. You blew up one of the generators! We might actually get out of here! Here's how it's gonna go down. You point, I can win. I thought I'd seen it all. What the hell is that thing? All shiny things are, but I'd stay away from them if I was you. Hold on there. Don't take enough.
One more of those damn generators to go, and we can get the hell out of here. Yeah! Only... Sure I do. I found a secret place they... One more generator. Heck yeah. I can take apart and put together a protectron with my eyes shut. I'll go with you. Lead on. Yes. Hurry up taking out that last. Yeah, sure did. I can make more, but I'll need around. You know, what happens down there? If you got something, you. No idea what his. Shiny machines and such. Gotta find a generator, huh? Let's see. How about we start with that teleporter thing? This place is incredible. Can you imagine having stuff like this in a waste? It wouldn't even be a match for the Brotherhood of Steel. I'm not totally sure what I'm doing here, but I'll try and tinker with it. You just make sure I don't get shot, okay?
Yeah? Something... You're mine, sucker. Now you're gonna have to go outside of the ship. I know it looks scary, but that's the only way to the top. Oh, make sure you wear a spacesuit before you go out there, or you could die. Don't forget!
Just between you and me, I'm surprised at how well I'm coping. I mean, I think I'm coping. Unless I've just lost my mind already. I'm, this is kind of exciting, isn't it? I've never seen this part of the ship before. Didn't think I'd ever see something like this. That's really something. Almost enough to make you forget we're running for our lives up here. Sorry, I should get the door. Hang on, okay? Did you see that? Scary, but also kind of a stupid move on their part, don't you think? Oh, come on. You don't need to understand it to get the point. Some kind of a threat. And if they're threatening us, it's a good bet we are starting to scare them a bit. Now, you ask me. We need to find out what that was and make sure it doesn't happen again. But at least we know we're getting somewhere. Oh no! They turned this one off too! You're going to have to find the other end and turn it back on. That doesn't seem like a very good idea. If they turned it off, that means they know we're here. And they're probably waiting on the other side of that door. It'd be smarter if just one person went and checked it out. Don't worry, we'll be safe right here. Good luck. Oh! Ah! 
Good. Well, it looks like they're still keeping some of these turned off. But there's one that's on. So I guess that's the way we go. You should probably go through...
Stella Skyfire reporting for duty. She's Captain Cosmo's second in command, at least for the first few episodes. I think I have that ship targeted, but you'll have to find the firing control. Looks like they're dropping shields. Here for a big shot. Never thought I'd get to do something like this. Shit, they hit the core and sapped out power. Look around for some buttons or something to restart the generators. That looks like it's working. Keep up whatever you're doing.
we could beat them! You're even better than Captain Cosmos! I know. And you're very welcome. I think I'm gonna stay here for a while. I don't think I like it much down there anymore. And there's still a bunch of the ship I haven't seen. I'll tell you what. If I find anything really neat, I'll bring it to you. Okay? I'll keep... What can I do for you, Mr. Hotshot Space Captain? If there's more of them out... And it looks like you're now... Yeah, that's one way of putting it. That's right. If it weren't for me, you'd be sitting in a hole. You owe me... I'm gonna see about getting off this thing. Head back to the wasteland with some new toys. Literally, if I have to. Odds are we won't be bumping it. We did it! We really did it! Oh man, I can't believe it! I never thought we'd make it. You're the best, the a- Oh, come on. I don't know. I don't really have a place down there anymore, do I? Think I'll stick around? Hey, I thought you should know, someone must have hit a button during the fight just now. If I understood the display correctly, I think we sort of launched a homing beacon of some kind down to the surface. Landed just outside DC. I wouldn't mention it, except that I think... Like I said, I'm not sure. I think it's a way to get back to Earth. Seems like there's a teleporter in the captain's quarters. I mean, I guess they're your quarters now. So I, I guess you can go home if you want. Oh, don't worry, I'll stick around up here and keep an eye on things. <laughs>